Ladies and gentlemen, the future is here. Do you want to be a part of it? I fucking don't. Freak diving accident and uh, dislocated my C4-C5, so I'm a complete um, quadriplegic. So this man is paralyzed and he's just had the Neuralink, he's just had Elon Musk's technology planted inside him. Um, I beat you in chess like once, so yeah. Yeah, yeah I... <laughs> I have, I do have a pretty good record in yeah. chess right now. Um, as we're on. All along here. Yeah. Record. This is a... Yeah. How's it going, Gracie? <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So this man is playing chess with his mind. The future is here and we have landed in it. I am a little bit scared, my goodness me. He is controlling everything with his mind. This is like telekinesis powers. X-Men are jealous of this shit. This is like without having the drawbacks, you just get a little implant in your brain. And well, I, I don't know what to say, guys. Not only that, this man has been able to tweet using his mind. He thought of a tweet and my God, it came true. He tweeted it Bang, it's there. I don't know if you call it. All I'm thinking about is this dude right now. Terminator Tom. Jeez, goddamn, son. It's over. It's over. So what's my opinion on the Neuralink? Well, I think it's actually a pretty cool piece of technology. Obviously, if you are paralyzed or have certain issues with your sight, hearing, in the future, it could potentially save you. However, this is some out of a horror film, bro. You know what I mean? It truly is. If this shit's getting put in your brain, what's stopping people from controlling it and taking, you know, over your mind and forcing you to do things? I know that sounds crazy, but it's, it's a good thing it's Elon Musk. I tell you now, if it was the government doing this shit, they'd already be planted up our assholes and controlling everything we do they can't wait oh my god you can register oh fuck join Neuralink's patient registry <gasps> current and future Neuralink trial bro oh fuck us only thank god i was gonna say in maybe 10 years time it might be the coolest thing ever i can't lie it might be really interesting to you know get something shoved at the back of your brain and be able to type and think using your brain and access computers remotely cool but I'm not being the first fucker. I'm not being the first million fucker, all right? If this goes wrong, I want to be able to look at all of them and go, <laughs> thank fuck I didn't do that. Almost like the COVID vaccine. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, but clinical trials are now taking place. And my God, I'm not being a part of it. Sorry, United States of America, you once again are the guinea pigs. I feel sorry for these guys. I know they have a lot of people, but every time something goes on, you know, trialing or trying to see if something works, it's always the Americans. Just they'll, they'll be the guinea pigs. Yeah, so basically, if it works, it can restore things that you might be missing, like movement in the legs, which is obviously positive. It might be, you know, spinal problems, sight problems, hearing problems. And the long-term goal I hear, or I think, is to be able to alternatively bypass this and use alternative ways of using your senses, which sounds cool, but scary. Personally, I'm not volunteering. Hell no. Hell no. No, you are not putting anything in my brain. See, imagine if you got hacked. You know what I mean? It's literally like cyberpunk. You can hack someone and shut their, shut their eyesight down. Bro, you'd be blind. You know what I mean? If someone does a bit of hacking and turns off your senses, you couldn't walk, you'd crawl. That's my biggest fear. And I think it's a real fear, so I will not be volunteering. And I wonder how much one of these things costs. I don't I don't believe it's in, you know, the single digits. I think it could be thousands. So it's charged wirelessly. And one day you won't even need to charge them. You know what I mean? Like, this is just the start. Surgical robot. Inserted by the human hand or surgically robotted. So you don't even need a human to put it in your head. Jeez, Christ! That is bonkers! Dude, the more you read, the more scary this shit gets. Fast and reliable computer control. So it's like this, you say, let's get your sensor, look up. Whoa. Dude, I swear in my life I just looked up and it did it. It's already in my head. They've already taken control of my body. But yeah, I mean, how many films and games and shit do you have to play and watch to actually understand that this is only going to go wrong? Don't get me wrong. If someone said, chop off your arm and we'll give you a robotic one like the Winter Soldier, I'd be like, bro, I'll do it right here, right now. That's not a problem for me. I would love to do that shit. That'd be so, so cool however things in your brain you know stuff like that if humans were men to have autumn or you know mechanical objects hanging out of them and implanted i feel like we would be born with them would we not i don't know a repulsor would be quite cool like a missile launcher maybe like you know what i mean but that's the problem when does this shit end it will just go on and on and on until you have literally cyberpunk cyber psychos who are literally like a walking death machine they have turrets popping out their ass cheeks they have laser eyes like superman they have bloody nails that shoot off like spikes like wolverine like you know claws it's gonna be crazy i can't wait to see the chaos push <laughs> happen <laughs>
All jokes aside, obviously, this is a very cool time to be alive if it goes well. Um, if it goes wrong, then, well, we're all fudged even more than we already are. And I think it's going to become very hard to control and limit and, you know, decide what's right and what's wrong. Like this guy here is not, can't walk and he's able to control a computer and soon he'll be able to walk using a chip in his brain. How does it work? <laughs> Fucking who knows, mate. But it, it can only be a positive for things like that. As soon as the people, you know, at the top start getting whiff with it, they, they won't allow it. No, you can't have people access. Accessing, you know, you could be so smart if you had a chip and you're able to access the internet anywhere, any old place. You can literally get up every piece of information you ever need all the time. You wouldn't even need to think for yourself. You never have to read a book again because you say, find out what happened 1866, blah, 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 bang. There's a Wikipedia page. You got it up, all right? And that shit might be cool until it's not. And I think Elon Musk is on the brink of changing the world for better or good. And I think the problem is we'll probably find out when it's too late. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'd love to have a robotic arm. It would be cool as shit but i don't think it's going to happen i just don't think it's possible to uh not have a robotic arm but i just don't think it's going to be possible to get a cool one you know what i mean i want one a soldier one like some of that when you punch someone it makes a world shake you know what i mean everyone goes fucking hell that was that was cool and look i don't really want to play chess with my mind either so if this starts you know evolving into iron man suits and like you know oculus rift glasses where you can see things in front of you and start controlling like lights with your mind and you know all that shit then i might start listening to the conversation because that is cool that would be very fun but until then i'm not having anything put in my brain again it's not really for me is it it's for people who actually have need it i get that but at the same time it's gonna there's gonna come a point when it's no longer about that and it's about the people the everyday people who want to get it now you know what i mean control your tv by your mind turn it on turn it off this that and the other turn on bulbs shoot flames out your arms you know what i mean it'll, it'll come to a point where we're, we're literally like metal monsters which might be quite cool i don't know if the world goes to shit, it would be cool to have like a blade, like a hidden blade. I'm an assassin. But yeah, I think I just wanted to have a little discussion on this. I think it's going to go terribly wrong very quickly, but I'm here for it. You know, I'm here for a good time, not a long time. So I say let it let it spiral out of control and let's see what occurs. Elon Musk, um, good luck to you, mate. I think there's going to be chaos and there will be a lot of it. But yeah, I, I think it could be a very good thing. A positive, shall we say. I don't think there's anything that could go wrong with it, ever. Wah, wah, wah. No, but seriously, let me know what you guys think. Are you going to get an implant? Imagine if you could listen to music in your head, like about headphones. That would be the dankest shit ever. I'd love that. That would be so cool. Anyway, are you going to get this implanted in your bum crack? Let me know.